What's going on, my fantastic people of YouTube? This is MK the Truth, the O D B E N T. Got some dope looking sneakers for us to look at today. If you guys are new to the channel, come on and join the family. Also connect to my Instagram. It is the underscore truth underscore MK. Also, ladies and gentlemen, all music is produced by me, DODB, and they will be uploaded on this channel as well. So first things first, my reviews are for educational purposes. Only people, this is MK's analysis. Then we jumping on up out of here. So what do I have for you today? Now it only came in this <laughs> this little baggie. I don't believe there's a box for this. I'm here for it, man. I'm here for it. So let's get a look at what I got. So it says 45 sample, not for resale. Okay. Okay. And I have what probably was going to be what should have been in my opinion because these are dope. The Air Max what's this? A it's a 90, 91. Oh, I get them mixed up. I get them mixed up. I know my squad will get at me down below because I only like them Air Max 1. But this is what's supposed to be a sample. I'm not sure. But this color makeup, man. Whew. But they need to drop these because these, well, these are hard. I like these. I don't know if Virgil was going to come out with this or what. Got this nice Nike Max. Okay, Max, Air Max 90. Gotcha, gotcha. Got this very nice little hang tag here. Very nice quality, man. God damn. So, like I said, I don't know if this was a sample. It says 45 sample on the inside. This is a clean, clean colorway. So, you have this Nike swoosh that looks almost greenish. Kind of got like a dark green. So, this, this sneaker is like a dark green and gray with a little bit of black. I like these, man. These are absolutely stunning. Very nice quality stitch. Craftsmanship looks good. Air bubble feels a little bit soft to the touch, but it's got some resistance. Feel a, little, a smidgen on the soft side. The sole is even like this sort of a dark greenish color. Very nice suede running down the sides. Got that, of course, ripstop material. Keep in mind, this is also one of those cheap materials with a little bit of real material here and here to make you get the illusion that it's a <laughs> really good sneaker. Flip around to the front, you see more of that green. These are cold, man. I like these. Very nice. Off-white Nike for Beaverton, Oregon. Air Max 90. Very, very clean, man. Of course, you got the gray stitch on the inside to help from seeing that uh, oxidation. That helps with seeing that oxidation. Man, these are... <laughs> So sample or not man these are a go and then of course you got the holiday 18 men's running 747 uh size 9 through 12 and a half they just use the standard stamp for all the size nines uh through nine and uh, 12 and a halves very very dope uh these should have come out i don't know if this was a like a friends and family thing or what but um <laughs> these are dope as hell anyway let me go ahead and peel this out all right, here's the other shoe. Ooh, might have to throw these on today or tomorrow. Oh, these cold, man. Let me feel it. Okay, this this air bubble got more resistance. This feels a, a lot better. Anyway, ain't too much else I can say about the shoe. Yeah, this is definitely a little bit like a greenish, smoke greenish. Got this nice gray on the bottom. What y'all think, man? Should Nike come out with this? Should they have come out with this? Should Virgil have... Uh, put this in one of the releases although i do i do love the colorways that he put out like that uh desert um the the first one that he did i think it's another one uh after this one but this was a go-to man i think they should have released this one as well anyway this is the 45 sample of i guess the all-white air max 90 i dig them man let me know what you guys think about these down below this is mk the truth d-o-d-b-e-n-t hey man i love y'all we out.